Oh snap. It came. That's right, boys and girls. The official first mod for the 440. Gloss black M4 style kidney grills. <laughs> this is the Amazon special. They were only like uh, 38 bucks or something. One day shipping, so it's pretty sweet. They're cheap, but had really good reviews. So let's go throw them on the car. And uh, if I like the way they look and they seem good quality, I'll be sure to leave a link down below. But I don't want to uh, tell people to try them out before I test them myself. So let's go throw them on the car. The last two days, they've been, I don't know what they've been doing, but that house right there with the thing out front, they've been jackhammering on the inside of it. There she blows, new car. Mm. So there's really nothing to it. There's no magical science toward taking these out. Uh, I know most people will, will say, you know, you should lift the hood and take off the weather stripping and uh, undo the bolts that, that hold the bumper together so that you can, you can uh, get underneath here. But I don't do any of that um, on my last BMW. That was not necessary, so I'm not doing that this time. Um, you'll see there's, there's clips on the inside here. There's, there's probably, I think there's three up top three down below and one on each side and if you just you can just get your finger in there and just gently bend down the clips you can you can obviously feel them and uh, yeah it's not necessary to pop your hood and do all that stuff just uh, just finesse it don't bend too hard because you don't want to break a clip but yeah you can just get your finger under there and just lightly bend and pull at the same time and you can just remove them like this So I got the first tab on the side here, and my God, that thing was in there. I just had to rip at it. I felt like I was gonna break it, but I didn't. <laughs> so this is obviously not the best way to do it. You risk breaking things, but you know these were 30 bucks and I'm willing to take the risk. You can see how much I'm tugging on it. And I'm pulling down. I'm pulling down really hard on the tabs on the inside. Another one. There's another one right here. And I need it. <sighs> like I'm cringing. I'm really pulling down hard. Yeah. This one on the side here. <clears throat> okay, that's out. Now just the bottom ones. Which are probably gonna be the hardest. The hardest ones are on the bottom. There we go. Now they're starting to come along. This one in the middle. There we go. All right. So it's kind of rough on your fingers, but as you can see here, let me, you can see the clips right there. So what you really have to do is reach in underneath and, and get a finger on the clip like that. And I'm doing it with two because you really, sorry, I'm trying to give you a good angle. You really have to bend down hard on these clips in order to get them to pop out. So you have to reach under with your hand and bend them down with your finger while, while yanking at it. So what I did, I started from the inside, from the inside tab here, and just really started yanking. Oh, top one just came out. Side one is out too. There we go. Now that I got the hang of it. There you go. There's the side one. It's in here somewhere, there it is. There we go. Yeah, this one's coming out a lot easier. Now just those damn bottom ones. There it goes. 
Come on, you son of a... There we go. It's just that bottom one. It's really giving me a hard time. There it goes. And honestly, I don't know if these are aftermarket to begin with or not, but these clips are so strong, not a single one broke. And now for the fun part. You just, you just pop them in. This is the easy part. Make sure the clips are all in. Give them a tug. Quality assurance. They're in. Wow. Wow, it's extra bright out here right now, but my God, looks really, really good. There's the old versus the new. Single spat versus double spat. This is the M4 style. So honestly, I mean, these were 38 bucks on Amazon. They had good reviews, so I expected good things. And uh, yeah, absolutely nothing wrong with this product. I'll leave a link in the description below in case anyone wants to buy it. That'll do it for the DIY. Literally the easiest thing you can do to your car. Um, like I said, there's no science to it. You really just uh, you really just need to get in there, get your fingers in there, and don't be afraid to pull hard. <laughs> if you break a clip, you break a clip. It's not the end of the world. So anyway, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. I hope somebody out there finds it helpful. Um, and I know people are gonna roast me for my absolute lack of finesse, but. Uh, I don't know, the, the kidney grill install, unless you wanna take the time to pull off all the weather stripping and everything and do it the right way, um, you know, it's just one of those things that you just kinda of have to get after it and figure it out for yourself. <laughs> There's not really a scientific way to do it, like I said. Um, but nevertheless, I hope this video helped somebody or gave somebody confidence uh, to just go figure it out for themselves. Anyway, hope you all have a great rest of your day and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.